What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix high ping in your Roblox when we are trying to play the Roblox you're having the issue with the high ping and how we can fix this app. So let's directly get into the step and I'm going to show you some of the steps that you can try in order to fix the issue with the Roblox and how we can do this. So the first and foremost step what we need to do is in order to fix this you just need to go over here search for the task manager over here and click on the task manager and make sure that you expand this. And once after the task manager is done over here, right now we need to click over here in the network over here. And right now this is quite from this you can understood that some of these kind of apps are utilizing the more performance on your system. Which means right now the Roblox game client which is using 40% of your GPU is one of the heavily used particular app on your system. So what we need to do is you can just keep scrolling down and you can come down, you can just remove the unwanted things. For example, this particular thing is not needed you can select this and remove it go for end the task and all those things similarly you can just remove the steam which is not needed you can go for end the task and steam is removed right now so you can do this similarly for everything over here right now you can just do a cross check whether which one is using the most of your cpu and based on it you have to remove the unwanted things you can keep the wanted things over here like the roblox is needed similarly the google chrome is needed and the obvious which is recording for the purpose and apart from this everything can be removed from here including the epic games launcher is not needed for the right time we need to just go for and the task remove it as well so this is what you have to do as the first step. Next step is all about apart from this, we just need to make sure the Roblox is added to the Windows security. So just go over here, search for the control panel and we need to click on this one. Go for system and security, Windows Defender Firewall and go for allow and import widget through Windows Defender Firewall and scroll down and check whether the Roblox is added or not. In most cases, the Roblox might be added. So if that is the case, if the Roblox is added, you're fine with it. You don't have to do anything. If the Roblox is not added, what we need to do is we just need to add the Roblox. So before that, what we need to do is just go over here in the Roblox and select this one and make sure where it is and start clicking the open file location. So it is quite important for you to understood the Roblox is over here right now. If you check over here, you can see it is installed on the admin app data, local Roblox versions, etc. So let me copy this over here, the location of the game should be copied and we need to minimize this now go for the control panel and click on change setting go to allow another app go for the browse right now what i'm going to do is let me copy and paste this particular location over here not here sorry we have to go over here remove this and we have to paste the location of the game and you have to press enter so right now it is directly taking you to the roblox folder over here and if you scroll down this is the roblox beta which you have to select this and you have to add it once the roblox game client is added what we need to do is just make sure one thing that you have put a check on both the boxes on the private and public so once afterwards you have to check with the roblox and if they show still there the next one is all about we need to get into the game over here in the roblox and you just need to go over here at the top we can do two method you can either plus escape that will take you to this one or you can just go over here click on this one and right now once you click on this one what we need to do is just go over here in the settings and there are some kind of tweak we need to make and one among them is all about if you scroll down you can see there is an option called graphic mode right now this has been set into manual or make sure one thing it might be automatic it might be manual so if it isn't automatic you have to make sure it is in manual and also the graphics quality can be lowered based on the pc performance so right now let me scroll let me lower this down like this so if you wanted to keep it much higher and if you're having enough spec for your computer we can keep this to the maximum or else what we need to do is you just need to scroll down this a little bit and make sure that you're going to do a little bit of sacrifice on the quality of the roblox and you can try or you can uh, change it up and right now we can see there is a small changes in the graphics which has lowered down and we have to move to the next step Next up is all about we just need to go over here, search for the CMD and we have to right click on run as administrator, go for yes. Right now what we need to just give the first command that is IP config over here and you have to put a space and what we need to just do like this, you have to put a space and use this particular button over here and you have to type flush DNS and you have to press enter. So right now once it is done, we have to move to the next one that is all about you need to type one IP config and you have to do is just space over here you have to type flash dns and you have to press enter and you have to move to the next one that is ip config over here and you have to put a space and you have to type register dns you have to type register dns and you have to press enter next one we need to type ip config over here and you have to put a space or you have to use the slash and you have to type release over here and you have to press enter you have to go for the next one that is ip config put a space 
is the slash and you have to type renew. So these are the steps that you have to try and once afterwards closes and you have to go back to the Roblox and this time when you're trying to play the Roblox that you don't be having any kind of issue with a high ping in the Roblox and it will be fine and you can do anything that you want to do in the Roblox and you don't be having any trouble. So this is what you have to do and I hope this video is helpful that's fine if this video helpful don't forget to subscribe that's it bye bye.